नमस्ते माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर हितेंद्र कुमार गर्ग वर्किंग एज ए सीनियर कंसल्टेंट इन गैस्ट्रोट्रोलॉजी हेपेटोलॉजी इन अपोलो हॉस्पिटल्स टूडे विल डिस्कस दिरोसिस एंड द मिथ्स विच आर प्रेवलेंट इन दी सोसाइटी टे विल डिस्कस अबाउट द मिथ्स एंड ट्राई टू क्लियर दैम आउट आई डोंट हैव एनी सिम्टम्स सो देर इज नो वे आई कुड हैव ए सिरोसिस सो इट इज ए मिथ पेशेंट्स of compensated cirrhosis more than 50% half of them they don't have any symptoms they have only mild loss of weight mild loss of appetite so mostly even more than 50% of them they don't have any symptoms but they have a cirrhosis so it's a myth i'm not drinking alcohol so i cannot have a cirrhosis again it's a myth liver disease or cirrhosis can be due to alcoholic liver disease it's a true it is happen other reasons also because of the hepatitis b hepatitis c and the nash related that is because of the obesity patient have a obesity patient have a diabetes patient is immobile patient has a dyslipidemia if i'll have a cirrhosis i'll get a liver cancer it's not true not all patients of any etiology they develop a uh, liver cancer however rarely 3 to 4 percent of the patient they develop a they, there are chances of developing a liver cancer cirrhosis diagnosis means a liver transplant will be needed in patients of cirrhosis there are two parts compensated and the decompensated the compensated cirrhosis they doesn't require a liver transplant they live a healthy life they require, they live a normal routine life in decompensated cirrhosis where the patient develop a jaundice ascites hepatic encephalopathy renal diseases initial when the child score is less mild score is less they don't require a liver transplant however in a later part once the child score is high the mild score is high they they are uh, decompensated they require a liver transplantation hepatitis can cause a liver cirrhosis there are many types of hepatitis it is because of the drugs it is because of the virus it is because of the alcohol so all not all hepatitis lead to cirrhosis but certain hepatitis like viral hepatitis due to the hepatitis b hepatitis c if the virus remain for a prolonged period in our body they develop a cirrhosis liver cirrhosis causes the yellow skin and pains the patients of liver disease like the cirrhosis the compensated cirrhosis usually they don't have a jaundice then they usually don't cause a uh, yellowness of uh, skin and if we talk about the pains it is not it is not at all related to pains not at all related to the cirrhotics mild body ache can happen but majority of the patient they don't have a pain in joints pain in uh, muscles if we uh, talk about the yellowness of skin later part once the patient develop a deep jaundice usually the bilirubin of more than 10 so today we discuss about the uh, cirrhosis the various myths what are the causes what are the symptoms and how to, how we should clear them out if you uh, come across any symptoms related to cirrhosis you must consult nearby physician or the hepatologist stay safe stay healthy stay informed namaste